in false hope news. Oh. I get that all the time. Really? How? What happens? Because I think I have too much of a big dream, and then um, I don't achieve it fast enough, and I go, oh. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> which what, which dream? Sugar cane. Oh. Well, that's one, but I think that's achievable. Mm -hmm. Another one is I want an 800 acre um, land that just got on for sale in in Maui, but I don't have. In um, Maui? How much yeah. is it? It's like 20 million. Oh, that's not bad. I don't. I don't have 20 million dollars. Dude, but no, if you take out a loan good. and then you go to Vegas. <laughs> yeah. I've been saying it all day. It's the smartest move. One mil loan. Yeah, I could probably only day. get a loan that's like not that much. Let's do it, dude. One mil loan, put it all together. Yep. All on red. All on black. But that's only a 50. Well, it's not All 50. on green. You only get you only get double those. So it's like if you put one million, you only get two million. Then we gotta what double you, what it. What if it gets on green and not lose? If, if it gets on that's green. too many chances. <laughs> Is it like times three or some shit on green? But if we all do it, and we all win. If you get a number, it's times 35. Oh shit. I seen somebody do it. While we were playing roulette, somebody yeah, came up. I was with you. Yeah, at the uh, Caesars, right? I think so. Yeah, yeah, so, so we were just playing, right? He puts 100 bucks. As we're playing, the ball is fucking rolling. He puts it on one number, boom, it hits. I was like, how did you get that? He goes, I was just feeling it. We were playing on that table for a long time too, and it came out of nowhere. Thirty-five hundred dollars, yeah. just like that. He cashed out and he left, and I saw him come back, and he was playing more, and I was like, Ah, this guy's gonna lose it. That all. guy owes yep. so much money. I yep. bet he's yep. addicted. Yep. Mm -mm. Who does that? Walk up and put a hundred dollars on one Bart number. Bart did that shit. That's what keeps on them one going. Number? Has Bart you... did it. I forgot if it was a number or color, but he put like a lot of money in this one thing, and I was like, "How, Bart?" And he actually won. I was like, I oh, shit. "Color's different. different. Color's different." Because I did that, and I and I. And, and yeah, I was there too. Right. Yeah. Just two to one. Has anyone oh. ever asked a guy who just lost? It's like flipping a coin. Has anyone ever asked a guy who just lost, like, "Hey, why'd you do that?" And then he's like. I was just feeling it. <laughs> it's the same shit, right? But you can't walk around with confidence though like that. You just no. go, I was feeling it. So what's this story? Oh yeah, what's this story? Submitted by Well Done Fries. They're not undercooked. No, I, me too, I like undercooked. She likes mushy. Me too. Okay. I like it a little soggy. I like crispy. They love soggy fries. Dude, we all had an argument with David yeah. on our podcast the other day because yeah. them two ganged up on me and liked crispy fries. You like, like crispy fries? Too. And I liked soggy fries, and then they're like, what are you talking about mushy fries? What, uh, you mean a mashed potato? I'm like, no, I mean a fucking french fry that tastes like a mashed potato inside. Yeah, she yeah, wants a like potato. She wants a yeah. french fries, like like a thing of french fries with a spray bottle down on it or whatever. No, I want to taste a fry that has potato flavor. Yes. Yeah, yeah. not burnt. Not What the, the fuck are you talking about chip. burnt? Crisp is not burnt. Or it's not air, because it's so yeah. fucking crispy, crispy, it just tastes air. Yeah, crispy. yeah, I hate that. Yeah, mm -hmm. and it's like, yeah, it's like a potato chip. Yeah. It's got crunch, that's all I want. We didn't have a Pringle then. We already did this in the podcast. Yeah, but now everyone's on my side now. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like it, that's what I'm saying. Let's what move is on. this about? Uh, so a 23-year-old claimed to be a boy that went missing seven years ago, but DNA tests uncovered an elaborate lie. So oh. they were a girl the whole time? <laughs> Surprised. I think it's just a, it's, he's just claims. I actually read this. He one. wasn't missing. But the person I, like is still missing. Oh. Oh right, the boy. Yeah. Oh, so he saw picture. a missing picture and he's like, oh, that was me. Timothy he looks exactly the same. Pitson. I've seen that picture. Timothy Pitson. Pitson. He, he went missing back in 2011 when he was six years old. His mom kidnapped him or like took him out of school, and then she went around and took him to a whole bunch of water parks, and then. It ended up where she was found dead, uh, like an apparent suicide, and then she left a note saying that Timothy was safe and in someone's care and that he would never be found. So since then, the family's been looking for him, and then this 23-year-old named Brian, who had just been released from uh, an Ohio prison less than a month ago, after serving time for burglary and vandalism, claimed to be Timothy after he was found like just lurking around. Because he wanted to get the family to take care of him. He wants a new identity. Uh, he's um he's he's just not mentally all there. So yeah. can you be, can you imagine being that this fucking was Timothy crazy? when he was he how was that not him? This is Timothy no, when Timothy, he bro. went missing and oh. then they did an age progression oh. of what he would look like after oh. years later. Mm -hmm. That's trippy. I thought it was the actual guy that was claiming. I know, I was and like, that looks like his brother or something. This is Timothy again with his parents. Oh, that's sad. So the dad is like devastated. Cause he looks like sad. his dad too? Yeah. What? What was going on where she had to run away this with the This was kid. the guy. Oh yeah, they don't look the same. Mm. Nah, he looks like he liked to sell 
euros and he's shit. He's claiming to be a 14 year old, <laughs> but in reality he's a 23 year old. He doesn't look He's 14. got a beard. Oh, he's claiming to be 14. What the fuck? Damn. Maybe, maybe if he was Armenian, he would pass for a 14 year old. Dude, or if he was a soccer player in like Brazil. That's so sad on the parents though. They're like, oh, by the way, we found your kid. They're like, hell yeah, psych. What was that one with uh, Angelina Jolie? She's like, I want my son. Where has my son? Changeling or something? Change, uh, something like that. Oh, dude, what about that sick Mel Gibson movie where he's like, give me back my son, Ransom? Yeah, that's fucking sick. Yeah. <laughs> I'll do movie quotes with the cats all day. Yeah, well, but, really but mine was so. mine was more yeah. relevant no. to the story. Yeah, because like her son went missing, and then they were like, "We found your son," and it was some other kid. And she's like, "This isn't my son." They're like, "Yes, it is. Yes, it's just your like son." That's like what they do to kids with rabbits and shit. Yeah, yeah, she's like, "I want my son. Get me my son. <laughs> I want my son." Yeah, changeling. Oh, it's a movie? Have you guys seen that? Uh, 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 I, I, I was oh, like, one of her adopted children, uh, and then like her fucking team goes and brings a fake or another kid. It's like, yeah, it is your kid. It's, that can it's another Cambodian. Okay, movie. fine. Tell me what happened. <laughs> well, it's a serial killer, and he kidnapped <laughs> all these kids at once, and like most of them were dead. But she was like some important person, so like they tried to get her her kid back, but the kid wasn't there anymore because he was murdered. And so they gave her another kid, and the kid was like, "Mommy, mommy." And, like she, he was like playing the part for Whoa. real, and then she's like, "This isn't my no, you're not my son. You're not my son. I want my son. Where is my son? I want my." And then and then they're like, "That's your son," and they try to convince her she was crazy. Have Damn. You, have you guys seen? Uh, Olympus has fallen, where the White House gets taken over by terrorists. Yeah. And there's a part where the Secretary of State won't give up the fucking nuclear codes or some shit. And then, uh, and then these Chinese guys like start wrecking her or whatever. They start like slapping her in the face yeah. and shit. And she's like, I'm never fucking tell you. And she's like spitting blood up. Yeah, that's a sick quote. <laughs> Do you remember the one movie, The Others? Yes. And, and then when like it's like a ghost, and then the, and then she was like, um. Who, what happened? No, fuck, I forgot the quote. But then she ends up going like, I'll never tell. No, wait, that was another oh, movie. Oh, that was a Britney Murphy movie, bro. That was that movie. Like, I'll never tell. Skeleton King? No, that wasn't no, Britney that's Murphy. The, that's the with the Josh, what's his name from Mighty Ducks kid. The Mighty Ducks kid was in Skeleton King. Or, yeah, or Skeleton Gang or some shit. Skeleton it wasn't Skeleton King. Skeleton <laughs> King was the actress with the big ears. What's oh, her name? Charlie? Kate. Uh, Holmes? Kate Hudson! That's her name. Uh, the skeleton Hudson. key. You were way yeah. off. I was way off. She doesn't have ears. She does. she does. Pay attention. She hides them? See? Her ears. I'm like, whoa, I never noticed. Oh shit, you're I right. Holy shit. They are thick. Is she big. supposed to be an elf? Or a fucking wrestler? That's her. <laughs> Those are her ears. <gasps> Look at that one down are the bottom. Are you in Lord of the Rings? Oh, with the big hoop earrings? Oh, yeah, that one. Oh yeah, this one, this one. Whoa. Oh shit. It's kind of cute. Dude, did she get her ears done, bro? Cause, Cause she looks like a she looks like a she keyboard elf. In Hollywood. Dude, she's yeah. had her ears tamed since then. That. Those ears have been tamed. You know why? Cause her hair is so big and curly that it like makes oh, yeah. her ears look smaller. Mm. Yeah. Did you know the bigger earlobes you have, the more richer you're technically supposed what? to be? Some like weird fucking relationship what? that doesn't make any sense. You know what though? Yeah, Noticing her ears made me feel ears. better about my ears. That's how um, J Lo's butt made me feel when I was growing up. Cause mm -hmm. I had a big butt. People made fun made fun of it, and then. Like, and no, butts weren't in back then, okay? It's, you guys got it good now, but in the 90s, big butts were out, and then that big butt song came out, yep. and then, it, like, that's when it started getting cool. Ushered them in. Yeah. I don't know, I grew up around uh, Latinas and, and black, so, like, booty was always in. I got made fun of, of having a first girlfriend with a big butt. Oh, see? And all these guys are like, ha, she's got a big butt. What the fuck is that? Yeah, I love that. On TV, it was all like blonde, like skinny blonde girls with big boobs. Big yeah. boobs were in, They're but big that. butts, not in. And then I broke up with her because I was embarrassed. Damn, really? you could have had that big booty. You could have squeezed that booty. I know, dude. I felt so cock blocked yourself. Everyone secretly liked her butt. That's yeah, probably. Yeah. They were all butt hurt. Yeah, they were probably jealous. Yep. <laughs> they were all butt hurt. <laughs> you heard it. <laughs> that was funny. Butt hurt. Anyway, we were talking about oh, yeah. this guy. What about this kid. crazy guy? So, so now is he what's locked going up on? again? Oh, good question. Um, they're just saying that they did a DNA test and then they were that like, that's not him. What if the DNA stuff is wrong? Because he just macked with one yeah, of the yeah, inmates. The right he just fucking slow kissed one of the inmates before he came out yeah. and he spit in that thing and they're like. No, so he was claiming that he had been <laughs> held captive by these two guys and um, saying that they, like, one of them had a tattoo. Like of a snake, and the other one had a tattoo of like um, spider web, and then that luckily he was able to to run away, and so they were looking at all these different inns that he described, because um, he also described a vehicle, but obviously no one found anything because he made it up, 
and yeah the family is just like you know what don't send any hate toward him like you know we feel sorry for him he obviously needs someone in his life to care for him that's why he had to pretend to be timothy but we're never gonna stop looking for timothy i wonder what it's like to be that crazy though i just at the, as soon as i heard that news it's like how can you look at a person and go that was me mm -hmm. why are you trying to kill his dream yeah, why Who's you? dream? The, the guy, the, the 23 year old. I know, but I, no, I'm just saying, I want to live that. So I know what that feels like. I just want to say, 2,000 kids go missing a day in the United States of America. 2,000? Only 2,000? Yeah, but that's okay. a fucking lot, dude. I feel like there should be- Fucking 3,000 people died on 9-11 and we went to war with everybody. 2,000? 2,000 2, kids go missing a day. Okay, so what's the math behind that? 2,000 times 365. Can you bust out so a calculator? So it's like 730,000. I trust Nikki. And nobody cares. And nobody looks after. it up. It's not on the news every night. That's He's the only crazy. kid currently missing, though, What's in his mean? area, like his region. That's less than a percentage, though. Dude, when a plane goes down, well, they go it's like 300 people die down. or whatever the fuck, right? How many gets found? I don't know. Okay. Good question. Because people could go missing. True. But then they, they get found also, the next day. Or a week or whatever. Yeah. Probably not that many get found. I don't know. I don't that's know that. People, man. That's almost a million people. Well, that's almost a million kids. I don't know anybody that went missing. Where are they all? Yeah, well, I was about to say, where do they go? <laughs> uh, trafficking. Trafficking, bro. Yeah. If I'm a billionaire, I'm gonna be like, child finder Batman. Hell yeah. That's my job. That's tight. And I'm gonna use my special skills to kill all the child brothel owners. I love it. And or I'm, maybe I won't kill you. them, I'll put them to work. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> of those, there are 150 chi 115 child stranger abduction cases every year, which means that the child is taken by an unknown person. So it sounds like a, the majority of these are by people that they, that they know. know. Sure. Damn, man, so I gotta trust my friends less. Mm -hmm. It could also be your cousins, your friends, yeah. uncles, aunts, who knows? It could be Mom, your significant dad. other. Yeah, exactly. Could I, be. I think that's most of the time, actually. It could be, could be, yeah. I, they're I trying to take away from, from the mom or the like dad. Like in this case, the mom took the kid and yeah. she couldn't yeah. commit exactly. suicide. Too many, man. And, no, and nobody ain't nobody give a fuck. That's my, See, that's my. That's why you don't want well-behaved children because if you have fucked up kids, nobody wants to kidnap them, nobody. <laughs> they're like, oh, this one's trouble. Or they don't feel bad about torturing him. Her. Oh, never mind. And I'm woke on this subject because a friend of mine, his brother went missing when he was a teenager. Did he find him? No, they never found him. Oh, that's oh. fucked up. He was at UCLA and he just started going to college and he... Oh, so he wasn't a child. He was like a teenager, yeah. yeah. But then, yeah, he um, he went missing and they never UCLA? found him. UCLA? Mm -hmm. You know, he probably got drunk and then went swimming in the ocean at night with his friends and... He was, there was no friends. He was uh, playing a video game late at night, and then um, he just went missing. He, the dogs followed him to a bus stop, and they never found him. Crazy.